Joe and Diane, in the history of the effort to advance personal, political, and economic freedom to all people, you, along with Dave Padden, surely have written a major chapter. Joe and Diane, thank you for your leadership at the Heartland Institute, 30 plus years, your leadership of the Liberty Movement in the United States. Thank you, Joe and Diane, for your incredible work, not only with the Heartland Institute, but really moving the needle toward freedom and free markets for the planet. Well, Joe, you've uh, done a world of good for the cause of liberty, fighting so-called conventional wisdom with the real wisdom and the real truth. Diane and Joe, thanks so much for the indefatigable work you've put into the Heartland Institute and all of the good that you've done to promote liberty. Congratulations, Joe and Diane, on decades of accomplishment, achievement, and setting such a great example for all of us in the free market movement. I have known Joe and Diane Bast since literally the day that they started the Heartland Institute in 1984. And I want to congratulate them for surviving the free market movement and, and getting out alive, as it were. Joe Bast is one of the great policy entrepreneurs of all time. Our mutual friend and board member, Dave Padden, really made the right choice when he picked Joe Bass to run the Heartland Institute. David Patton uh, hired Joe Bass according to the what the David said was that Joe was cheap. <laughs> he was also very talented too. There have been victories state by state at the national level because of what you've accomplished with and through the Heartland Institute. They fought a battle for all of us and for all who come after us, and they deserve the warmest thanks and congratulations for that. And I give them on behalf of Hillsdale College. Especially thank you for giving indigestion to all of the enemies of freedom in our country. It's only logical that uh, we should uh, revive the uh, bourgeois capitalist running dog lackey society and we'll just call that Heartland for short. And Joe, I don't know of anyone who surpasses you in your understanding of the principles of a free society and your and Diane's ability to transmit those ideas to what probably could have been millions of elected officials. We need to clone you so we have thousands of you around the country. Joe and Diane Bast have shown all of us the impact that a relatively small thing tank based in the nation's heartland can have on the national and even global policy debate. You've committed your lives to sound policy, and I hope that retirement doesn't mean that you disappear, that you'll be back in the game in one way or another, but also taking a well-deserved rest. I wish them all the great joys in their retirement, and the legacy they have left at Heartland is something that we should all be most grateful and, and feel blessed about. Well, they've uh, built an institution uh, they've made it succeed and last, so much so that they can work their retirement through it, knowing that it will go on to work and success in the future. We're going to miss you so much at Harland, but uh, enjoy uh, retirement, and then why don't you come back in about five years? So, Joe and Diane, congratulations for everything that you have done to make Heartland Institute the powerhouse that it is today across the country best wishes as you travel the waterways of the world.